Yankees fans, yet again, another video. This has been four for today. John Heyman just broke. Is he bored or what? Does he want traffic to his website? Who knows? John Heyman just tweeted out this, that the Yankees are interested in Mike Moustakas. We already knew that. But he says that the Yankees are monitoring the situation with Mike Moustakas where, let's say, if his price comes down, or really, he doesn't get a better deal. Because, let's say, I don't know why the Yankees will sign Mike Moustakas now that I think about it. It's going to be for one year if they sign Mike Moustakas. And it's pretty dumb if he does sign for, for one year because he's going to have a lot of competition for 2019. We already know that. So anyways, he says it's a long shot, but I, I'm guessing if Mike Moustakas wants like $20 million for a year or something like that, $25 million or something like that, then he will sign with the Yankees. But it just doesn't make sense, guys, if the Yankees are going after Manny Machado and let's say they don't get Manny Machado. Nolan Arenado becomes a free agent in 2020. So... I don't know, is John Heyman bored here? Leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. I mean, do the Yankees go after Mike Moustakas? Can he be obtained for a year? If he's not getting what he wants this year, what makes him think he'll get what he wants next year with all these free agents on the market? Is there something we don't know that teams are just waiting to spend their money next year? Who knows? And no, I don't want to hear about war. Oh, Ellsbury had a bigger war than Moustakas. Moustakas is horrible. He's a legit player. I mean, I don't, I'm not a firm believer in that war stuff. I think Mike Moustakas on any team would make any team better. So if it's for one year, then you, hey, yeah, get Moustakas. But if it's for more, then it makes no sense. Absolutely no sense. But like I said, if it's for a year, go for it. John Heyman is also saying that the Yankees are concerned about the luxury tax and draft picks or whatever. I don't know, man. The Yankees have a whole bunch of closers that anytime, if the Yankees felt like it, they can flip those closers for prospects. So I don't see why the Yankees are concerned about draft picks. If, let's say, you can obtain a Moustakas for one year, that's legit right there. But also, when you think about it, the Yankees are going to lose out on draft picks. But if they go after, let's say, they trade for a Manny Machado, because really, the Yankees have no third baseman and no real backup. It's the same thing. You're going to lose out on prospects regardless. So, I don't know where the Yankees are coming from when it comes to Moustakas and ignoring a Manny Machado. As my boy Samanetti Source tweeted today, he said, if the Rays are considering trading in their own division, then why can't the Orioles trade in their division as well? So there you have it, folks, at 11news.com, bringing you the news as it breaks. Like always, share, like, and subscribe. I will check you out next time.